The Army has just announced a brand new PT test, the first time it's changed in 38 years. So what you normally think of in an Army PT test is your run, your sit-ups, and your push-ups. But this new test is six events that take place over 50 minutes uh, and finish off with a two-mile run. The biggest change in this test is that it will have an age and gender neutral scoring scale. So no matter whether you're a man, a woman, a 45-year-old sergeant major, or a 19-year-old private, it will have the same standards. And that's a huge deal because the PT test as it is now is more of a health-based test and technically there are different health standards for men and women. What, how many push-ups you can do, how far, how quickly you can run. So in having those neutral standards, there's a lot of heartburn about who does this affect. And what the Army is saying is there will be one standard for men and women and for ages, but there will probably be different levels of standards. So there will be a minimum basic that you need to serve in the Army, and then either according to your MOS, the job that you do, or the kind of unit that you serve in, so an infantry brigade, a medical brigade, an engineering brigade, there will be different standards there. So while it will be the same for men and women, and again for 19-year-old privates and 45-year-old sergeants major, there will be different standards. It will be harder, basically, if you are in, a, uh, in an infantry unit rather than some sort of support unit. So almost as soon as the existing Army PT test was fielded 38 years ago, there were questions about does this actually measure fitness and does it, even more importantly, does it m measure combat effectiveness? And the answer for a, pretty much all of those years has been no. So this has been a long progression of science, of studies, of feedback from the force, of feedback from unit commanders about a, a, a test that is, is scientifically viable that actually mimics some of the things that a soldier would do in combat, but is also scalable so that any unit in the Army could do it with a small amount of equipment and in under an hour, which is the plan. So starting this October, the Army is starting a field study that will last a full year, testing 60 battalions to figure out what the standards should be, whether it should be MOS, brigade type, that sort of thing. And then the Army has until October 1st, 2020, to finalize those standards and push them out. So the main message is this test is coming. It will replace the Army Physical Fitness Test as it is now, but they're taking plenty of time to weigh the effects and change the policies uh, that it will affect.